Hello, my name is Ilona and today it's Monday, November 14th, 2022. And first I want to take a look at FTX slush fund. Apparently they went bankrupt, but something very interesting. There's an article from Natural News actually talking about that this fund was used to launder, launder uh, Ukraine donation money to Democrat candidates to help rig midterms. So this is interesting that this is not coming out. I think they are missing like 1 billion as well. And questions have been asked to the person that's running this FTX crypto slush fund, Sam Bankman Fried. It's very interesting that this is coming out, but it laundered money for the Ukraine into nearly 40 million worth of campaign donations for Democrats in the 2022 midterm, well, what just happened. So it's very interesting that this is now coming out. And I was wondering what the energy was, uh, well, this crypto slush fund and what's going on. Unfortunately, I do not know a lot about crypto, but I thought this was very interesting. The first card I got is the Two of Cups. The central card I got is the Fool, and of course I already uh, did my card, uh, I shoveled the cards in my Dutch reading, so if you want to see that, you can watch the Dutch video. In the past we have the Three of Wands, underneath the central card, underneath the Fool, we have the Sun, and then for the near future we have the Justice card. And we have the Two of Wands and I got an extra card, which is the Wheel of Fortune. So this is very interesting to me. This is about healing. So I think things purposely coming out now, I think this is really the beginning of the uh, falling of that crypto systems and anything that is not backed by gold and silver. I think it's going to completely collapse, especially with the Fool. That's like the beginning of a new cycle. So this is opening everything and I think because the fool is about opening spontane spontane spontaneity a uh, new way of thinking and I think this is just opening everything about this crypto and what it's really used for also for hor horrible things like with children the sun to me feels like children connected to children of course we know bitcoin has been used for a lot of things other cryptos as well, the dark energies have been using this on a way to um, finance all kinds of things they have in mind, all kinds of uh, dubious things they've been doing, but it's all opening up. That's what the sun is about as well. It's shining a light on this, what's really going on with those cryptos. And I think this is really symboling the beginning of a completely new way and justice is coming so i think more and more things are coming out this is like the beginning of the collapse of the crypto system i do believe that we are watching that the financial system has been crashing for a while but they'll try to artificially hold it up although we all know that's going to end and of course the banking system but also this crypto system that's not based on anything Justice is coming. This is about balancing things out, showing people what's really been going on. Uh, decisions have to be made, but the Wheel of Fortune is turning in the right direction for humanity. So I think more and more things are coming out. Right now, it's of course about laundering uh, certain money to uh, funnel it back to the Democrats. But I think more and more things are coming out where this money has been used for especially with cryptos like Bitcoin, a lot of things. It's been used for all kinds of, well, horrible things, so to speak. And I think it's going to come out more and more. This is really about justice. This is about balancing. This is about opening up. So I think this is very important that this immediately after the midterms is starting to come out. And of course that the FTX slush fund is uh, gone bankrupt. Very interesting. The timing is very interesting. Feels like a white hat action to me. We'll have to wait and see, but more and more is going to come out. The second thing I wanted to take a look at is the digital euro. They really want to push that through here. Apparently in March, 2023, they want to start using that here in the Netherlands and probably in the European Union. Uh, we have of course our queen really pushing this. So I wanted to see what the energy is of this digital euro. They want to combine it with the carbon footprint. I also shared uh, 
video clip from I believe the CEO of Alibaba talking about that there's now going to be like a carbon footprint so people will know why they're you know when they're buying something what kind of carbon footprint there is uh, we have a bank in the Netherlands the Rabobank already has this I think since April this year so they show you your carbon footprint and they're just what you buy and apparently I don't know exactly how they uh, come up with that but I do know that they show that at the end of your, your uh, how you say this if you watch your account online you can see your carbon footprint and let's face it they all want to combine it so they can control your behavior and I'm sure they're going to combine it with other things maybe like the wasp sting so if you want entry to your money or this digital euro, you have to do certain things. You have to be a good girl and a good boy. Otherwise, you won't be able to uh, reach your money. It's like the social system they've used in China in certain parts. So let's just see what the cards will have to say. Well, first we have the sun. That's interesting. The central card is the knight of swords. The card in the past is the seven of pentacles underneath the knight of swords we have the seven of cups and for the near future we have the ten of swords and the king of swords so to, to me this immediately says no this is not going to happen this is like a radical ending to something and i think this digital euro is not going to actually happen not in the way they want things to happen so this is not going to get very far but they're pushing it they are really pulling out all the stops, the dark energies to push this through. They are confused. They are in panic. Things are kind of, uh, they're running out of money. And this, of course, will give them an opportunity to create more money. Obviously, with the digital euro, they'll be able to manipulate this. But they're running out of, of money. They're, they're in panic. That's what it feels like. So they're trying to push this all through. But... Someone is shining a light on that. Someone is watching this closely and the King of Swords ultimately will say no to this. So I do think the White Hats are of course following this, seeing who's promoting this, seeing how they're trying to implement this so they can clean that swamp as well. So they're just using this, but the dark energies are in a panic. They really try to push it through. As you can see, the Knight of Swords is about to get ready to fight to push this through. And it's completely based on the fact that they're completely, yeah, how to say this, uh, confused. They don't know what to do anymore. Money is, is, they're losing money. Of course, this FTX fund is also stopped getting their money. And I think a lot of other sources have been drying up and they really need this money to, of course, maintain all their, all their things they've been doing on the side and it's not going very well, but it's not going to get that far. That's my feeling I'm getting with this, this digital euro they try to come up with. It's not going to happen. I'm not sure if this is going to be in completely near future, but it's not going to happen. That's not in the way they want to and not with the dark energies. This great reset they have in mind is not going to happen this way. The people are watching them very closely and anyone they can clean up so to speak is uh, being taken care of i think they just use this to see who who's going to do what to implement this and how uh, how they want to uh, how to say this get this in action so to speak so they're watching it very closely and they will pull the plug when the time is right we've got the king of swords and let's see the third one uh, card reading I looked at was the explosion that happened in Istanbul in Turkey. I believe um, six people lost their lives. A lot of people were wounded in this situation. So my heart goes out to the people that were, uh, well, their loved ones were faced with this. Uh, it's a horrible situation. To me, this feels like the dark energies trying to create confusion. Of course, Turkey to me feels like they've joined the white hats they've joined mr p and mr x of china and this is like some kind of warning uh, the dark energy still still try to create fear and chaos so the first card i got is the four of pentacles this is the ten of pentacles that's the central card 
in the past is the nine of swords underneath the ten of pentacle pentacles is the magician and the future near future is the high priest and the ace of wands so to me this feels like this is dark energy they are trying to hold on to the power they've had once and again this is this also shows even though this is a horrible situation and i'm not trying to minimize that that they don't have these big weapons anymore to use they would have used that by now so still on a very small scale with horrible consequences this is what they're still capable of doing they still have people they can activate mk ultra people that will do things like this for them they will give them the order and they will follow through so they can still create on a smaller scale chaos maybe even force them or try to uh, you know say well if you don't do what we have to you know what we want you to do this will happen more and more and i think this is a warning sign to turkey they want to hold on to that old power but it's not going to change things turkey is in quite a stable situation now they have a new status quo and i don't think that's going to change it's more in their own power now they are capable of making better decisions and they are not going to turn back they are not going to turn back to the dark energies even though they'll try and things are going to come out if i'm not mistaken a lot of people were already taken in, into custody this situation so it's also part of draining the swamp all these groups of mk ultra people they have placed all around the world this is part of cleaning that up as well because unfortunately not much is most likely known about these people so the white hats won't know about them until they're activated and start doing things like this but this is again a way of cleaning up unfortunately that's uh it's it's sad what has happened like i've mentioned my heart goes out to everyone connected to this or maybe lost people in this this is horrible but it's also showing that they are losing power and that's actually what this ace of wands is saying for turkey a new energetic energy is coming in a new beginning energetically they are moving away from the dark energies and of course the dark energies don't want that but they are losing control there is a new status quo there is a new balance in turkey that will bring them into their own strength into their own authority away from the dark energies and that's what this ace of wands is about as well so there is really a change happening there and they might try things like this again but this is also an opportunity to take care of all these groups of people in turkey in istanbul or maybe coming in from other places they will say that this is part of an organization but ultimately this has to do with the dark energies because they are the ones behind all these certain organizations that create havoc that create fear chaos they are the ones putting them in place purposely done to create divide and conquer that's what they've been doing for so long so they make sure that, that they have the people in the governments they make sure that the organizations trying to rise against this government is also financed and made sure by them so they have the upper hand they are like the the third party just watching this all play out and they've been playing for a very long time and it stops now it's going to end well it's already ending and they're in a panic so this i see this as something they tried to create uh, fear and chaos it's, it's not going to work i do believe that turkey is quite stable and will take care of this with the help of the white hats i'd like to leave the this and i hope to see you in another video